Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to part 8 of Let's Play Stardew Valley. So, we're on to day 9 here, and we're getting well into this game. We've got the community center open, we can tell what we need to get, whether I can get it or not is a different matter. And yeah, so, start things off nice and easy, water all my crops, got quite a few of them here. And a scarecrow garden, so yeah, we're doing good. My farming is gradually getting better and better. I'm not good enough to get the quality sprinkler yet, which is when it really pays to go mining, when you can actually get some real benefit from it, but things are gradually moving on, so that's quite cool. I've definitely got to work on my fishing more. I know it seems like all I've done so far is fish, but it's really that useful, because it's such easy money. By the end of this month, I'll be pulling in five, six grand a day if I'm lucky, you know? So yeah, and that's great money this early on. Hell, for the whole first year, that's great money. Yeah. So yeah, it means that I'll be able to buy shit tons of seeds at the start of next year, and by that point I should have plenty of quality sprinklers about, and so money will be an effortless thing, it won't be a problem. Then I can just focus on finishing off the community center and building relationships with people, which is quite good. And that's the big bit, I have to pick a wife. If I want to complete this game fully, I have to pick a wife. So yeah, gotta start considering things long term. Anyway, good god, it's taken up half of my fucking energy already. Yeah, this is not good. Taking so much energy, it's worth it, let's be honest. Just gotta make sure I got a few fish about so I can restore my energy and then get back to, uh, you know, fishing. As long as we've got some, I'm alright. Yeah, I'm gonna be nearly out of energy by the time I'm done. Right, okay, and yeah, I need to check what crops I need as well. Right, done. So, got the water can, that's good. Now let's check here. Right, the pantry. Checking all of them, yeah, okay, spring crops. So I need a parsnip, a green bean, a cauliflower. I have some cauliflower on the way, so that's good. Got potatoes on the way, I will need to get parsnips and a bean. So that's alright, and it's Tuesday, so the shop's open. I'll eat my seaweed. Build my energy back up a little. And we will go get the other crops that I need. And I'm definitely going to need to get another box. I am fish! I'll take out all my fish and I'll check to see which ones I can use. And the rest I can sell. Yep, that's all good. Right, okay then. So, community center. Fish tank. River fish. I haven't got any river fish yet. Specialty fish. Nope. Ocean fish. Sardine, I don't have. Tuna, red snapper, nope, ain't got any of them. Not looking good so far, is it? I can get most of those now. Crab pot, I have a crab. That's good. And a night fish. Okay, so the crab and an eel, I gotta keep. That's not a problem. The rest of it I can flog. Right then, okay. I've got to save up plenty of resources as well, I need more wood and stuff. They like I say, I need another box, so I've got to do some, some form of wood chopping today. I can do with doing a little bit of mining, getting a little bit more copper as well, so I can upgrade one of my tools. I've nearly got two grand anyway, so that's fine. Anyway, for the time being, I'm going to head down, flog what fish I don't need, make that bit of money, and then debate what to do with the rest of the day. It'll probably be fishing, but I'm trying to think if there's anything important that I need to do or get. I don't think there is. Checking the beach for shells and stuff. A couple of those I can use in the community center, but other than that, they just make good money. The fuck will work. Right, okay, flog a eel. Flog all those, there we go, plenty. Fiberglass is still the best I can get. No trouble there. Okay, I'll go get access to the main shop. Pierre's General Store, and I need bean, and I need parsnip. Or A, bean and parsnip. I'll get those, and I'll plant them, and I'll water them. I should have enough time left in the month for the beans. Shouldn't be too much issue. Ooh, green algae. Oh, eating slimy green algae from a bin. Oh well. Can't be picky. Seaweed. Oops. I'll accept it, and if I find one, I'll give it to him. Oh yeah, and Vincent's birthday. He is fairly fond of daffodils. So that's good. Right, 
bean, yep, that's good, and a parsnip, that's all I need. I can't really afford the energy expenditure of much more than that, otherwise I'd buy a whole batch. It doesn't matter. So yeah, I'll plant these, and then probably just go do some fishing or something the rest of the day. Because I haven't been doing a lot, I should be further along than I am. What level am I at now? Five, yeah. One of the war one of the run-throughs I saw on this, the guy was at about level eight by now, so I feel like I'm falling behind. Anyway, ho oh. bean, parsnip, water. There we go. At least the parsnip won't take very long. Right, I'll head on up. I think I will go down into the mine actually. I'll do a bit of fishing to get a few fish so that I've got some energy reserves about. And then I'll head down in the mine and get enough copper to get five copper bars. And then I'll be able to upgrade a tool. And I'm deciding it's either the axe or the pickaxe. I don't know what to do. Because I'm not going to bother upgrading the watering can for a long time. Because when you do, it takes away the ability to stand in the middle of water around. You know, it gives you the ability to water more in one go, but I find that ability to just stand there and do the lot in a row. I find that a lot more convenient. Anyway, crab goes in there. That's good. I can get most of those. Let me think. I can find them, them, them. Yeah, I don't think I'll have to actually worry about getting a lobster pot. I just gotta keep my eyes peeled. Anyway, it was night fishing. Eel. I can't when those two appear. Probably in different months. But yep, yeah, so that's cool. Getting on with that. And we're off up top. Small daffodils. They make pretty good gifts. I don't know why everyone seems to like them to some degree or another. Except for Lewis, of course. For his birthday, I could get him nothing he'd like. I could just make him hate me. Or feel completely indifferent. And the guy already thinks I'm crazy for being able to see those magic creatures. You know, in the community center. And he couldn't see them. So I probably shouldn't do anything to make him even more suspicious of me. I'll take that coal. Oh, I'll keep the daffodil on me. There aren't enough variations of fish here to fill up my inventory now. Now oh, I've got that extra bag. And yeah, let's like say, I'll catch a few, and then we'll go mine in. Need to try to kill ten green slimes as well. Well, not just green ones, but the only ones I'm going to see for a while are green ones, so... Here we go. You can see how big the bar's getting now. So much easier to fish now. And they all seem to be coming in gold. Well, not all of them, but most of them. Got to make sure I try to get perfects. Unless there's treasure. It's always worth giving up the fish. Or giving up a perfect for treasure. Ah, oh, he's silver. Screw him. More bait. Very nice. Really helps me save money on buying more bait. And again, for this first month, money is everything. I've got to save up as much as I can. Just, you know, get as many seeds as I can and all that stuff. There we go. More algae. That's nice. If I can get a seaweed, that'd be pretty cool. Got that mini quest to do. More green algae. Not quite what I was after, but whatever. Come on. Here we go. Oh, another treasure chest. I'll have to kiss my perfect goodbye. Kiss my fish goodbye if I'm not careful. Come on. Get up there. Yep, got the chest. And I've got my fish. Alright, coal, sweet. Again, coal in the beginning of the game is fairly rare compared to the other resources. So it pays to get good hold of it. Get a hold of as men uh, as much as you can. Come on, give me more fish. I want more algae. I don't need algae. I need fish. I'm gonna go mining today after all. Come on. And I might start keeping a hold of my fish as well. Because I'm planning on doing a lot of grinding between parts. If I can get away with it. If I've got time in the day to do it. And a lot of the plot related stuff will be done now. For the time being. So I can probably get away with just record. You know, not recording the next few days. And just fishing a lot. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. More bait. Fucking A. Like I say, it's really not dropping that much. God, this thing won't stay in. Not as uncomfortable as my old headphones were. Still what I'm about, but man, they made my head itch. They're irritating as fuck. Right, okay, that will do. I think I'll head into the mine. I've got plenty of energy reserves. Or I should do. 
Ain't worried about selling these, keep them for the experience. Now I will store all the tools that I don't need. Don't need that axe down there. Just that. Yeah. Coal I'll keep hold of because I'm likely to encounter plenty anyway. Yeah. Okay. So I've got a fair few energy reserves. Mainly I'm looking for 10 copper. That's it. That's not a massive amount of copper. I should be able to find that easily. Even if the spirits are planning on making it hell for me, we should be all right. <clears throat> right. And since we've accessed floor five, we can use the elevator. It's every five floors you get you know, the elevator, which is really good. Because when I first played this game, I didn't take no notice of that. I didn't notice it. I thought that you had to, like, on my uh, mission, get to floor 40. I thought you had to do it in one go. Basically impossible. And yeah, I could really do with a glow ring of some kind, because I can't see shit in the dark. I can see that ladder, though. But I've got ten slimes to kill. Gonna make that adventuring guy proud. Oh, they're dead. That's two. I'm a fifth of the way there already. I'll conserve my energy. I won't hit nothing unless I see copper, or I just have to find the ladder. Hey. Things are looking up already. Whoops. Two. So that's cool. I'm a fifth of the way towards that as well. Come on. There we go. Would give it a look round, but nah. The more floors I can get access to, the better. Got three copper now, I think. Good. A few more. Six. Pretty sweet. Quartz. Very useful. You need them to make the quality sprinklers. It's copper. Is it copper? No, it's iron, gold, and quartz. So yeah, quartz is well worth getting. Starting to run low on energy. I'll need to break into a few of my fish soon. Pretty low. I'll eat the low one, silver one. Got a silver bullhead I can break into without much trouble. Kill the green slime. But yeah, from what I've seen, this is basically just like Terraria, this part of Stardew Valley. It's just that game. I don't know which one come first, I don't know what the deal is there, but it's pretty cool. At any rate, it's really sweet. It just adds more dimensions to the gameplay, more stuff you can do. There's something for everyone in this game. If you haven't got it, I highly recommend getting it. Just go buy it, you know, play it. It's great fun. Really good way to unwind and all that, because it's a, you know, it's a farming game at its core. A relaxing country life gameplay. But yeah, go buy it. Alright, I got 12 copper, that's good. And I'm at level 10. Leather boots. Those will increase my defense a bit, makes fighting a bit easier on me. There we go, and that'll do. Yep. Four zero, please. Man, my hand's starting to hurt. I don't know why. Yes. So there we go. Right, I'm probably gonna fish for the rest of the day now. I'll probably leave this part here. I'll store all my stuff and then, yeah. Okay, bung it all in. And yeah, it'll be Vincent's birthday tomorrow, so I gotta give him that daffodil. Anyway, so I'm on my fiberglass, take my fiberglass rod out, all those. Yep, okay, sweet. So that'll probably do for this part, I think, because the rest of this day is just fishing. He needs a seaweed, I haven't got a seaweed. Yeah, okay, and I've still got to find Haley. So yeah, all right, so very much for watching, guys. I appreciate that. I hope to see you in the next video, and yeah, that'll do. So thanks again. Bye.